The following program contains graphic images that may be disturbing. Parents are advised that these images may not be suitable for young children. Melissa, who you saw in that video, joins us with more on how she discovered her daughter was involved in this blue whale challenge. And, and I have to ask you, Melissa, is why do you think that your daughter was a target and this curator of the game, who is obviously an evil person, found her? Uh, my daughter is on Instagram. so. She suffers from depression and anxiety. So a lot of the times she will hashtag depression or she'll follow other followers. She'll make comments, uh, make comments about, you know, yeah, I suffer from depression. Do you need to talk? And I think that people scope these out and realize and target kids that make it very noticeable that they are suffering from depression. How is she doing now? She's in seventh grade. I homeschool her. Uh, she does see a therapist. She's on medicine. Uh, she, she has her good days and bad days. Uh, before she, I put her in the mental hospital for seven days, mm -hmm. and while she was in there, I decorated her whole wall mm -hmm. and put lights, and I had a lot of people reach out from, I think, the Netherlands, Belgium. I had people send letters, messages, and I would print those out, and I'd stick them on the wall. So when she wakes mm -hmm. up in the morning and she's having a bad day, or when, in general, she's having a bad day, she can look and realize how many people appreciate her and love her. Melissa, I understand that you and Isaiah's parents have a special connection. Can you tell us about that? Yes, I, uh, when I realized that um, they were doing, their, their child went through this, I actually reached out on Facebook and I messaged her and let her know that my daughter went through it also. Um, she uh, gave me her phone number and we text every morning, we text every night. She'll have her bad days, I'll have my bad days, we talk about it. The one thing we actually um, realized when we were friends on Facebook is I was looking at her pictures of her son's gravesite, and I noticed he was born in April. And I asked her, I was like, you know, when is your when is your when when is your son's birthday? And she said April. And I took a picture of my daughter's birth certificate and I sent it to her, and we realized our kids are born on the same day.